Hey everybody, welcome back once again to another video, this time showing off my Blade the Vampire and Blade the Puppet artwork. Um, it's just no real um, idea to this other than just, you know, a pun, so, you know, it's a rather interesting one at that. And of course it's no um, secret I'm a huge Puppet Master fan and huge uh, Blade the series fan, or series of the movies. Uh, of course, I think the only the real one I've, I've ever seen was um, the Guillermo del Toro version, the Blade 2. Once you can see the um, super vampires from that, but still, I love everything about this character, the look, and just the just the story of the thing. Everything's, I mean, Wesley Snipes is just awesome. So, so it was just no big thing, just you know, just kind of Blade doing his thing, and of course the. Um, it was fun designing the vampires, too, because I wanted sort of a different thing with them. Of course, this sort of uh, neo-goth bar type thing. So, goth club type thing. So, And uh, the boots are uh, a new thing to him. He doesn't wear them, but I thought, well, I own a pair, and they look pretty cool. So I, thought, I just thought I'd, you know, put it on him. So. And the red inside the suit was a last-minute thing, because I was almost done with it, and uh, I was looking up uh, reference photos and just seeing the red inside the coat, and I was like, oh, shoot, I forgot, so I just, you know, quickly uh, did this thing, so, and it worked, for the most part. Um, getting the skin tone was kind of difficult, though, especially, um, uh, doing the shadow bits, so, and that took a while, but, you know, I managed to do it, so, worked out for the most part, so, uh, and, of course, and Blade as well, um, the other Blade, <laughs> kind of get confusing, but yes. um, it was quite easy, actually, although he's a lot smaller in stature, and of course, um, really hard to put detail on something that small compared to everything else, so, but, you know, it worked out, <clears throat> so it's kind of funny, so I kind of watched the cinema snob, and he was doing a, a review on the original Puppet Master, and he was making this reference, saying that, oh, this puppet's called Blade, because... Hook was taken by Wesley Snipes, <laughs> so so I kind of I think I kind of think of that now, seeing this now. So, but anyway, guys, that's about it. Um, I don't know what else. Just the blood spatter was a, I think a last minute thing too. So, because I didn't want to make the vampires bloody because you know I just cover up their details and I didn't want to do that. So, I kind of did an impression on blood on the background just to you know just have something like that, you know. So, anyway, guys, that's about it, and, uh, thanks for listening, and I'll, well, thanks for watching, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Hopefully get something up by next week, too, so, anyway. Thank you so much, guys, for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.